I'm James Foskis, and I am the director of Next Fall. I love Diversionary. This is my fourth show with Diversionary. I think it's an important theater for the gay and lesbian community to, to get our voices heard, our creative voices heard. And what I love about the past several years at Diversionary is it's becoming less about telling the the stereotypical stories that we may have heard before with the effort to really get our voices out there. And it's becoming more about telling human interest stories mm -hmm. um, from a gay and lesbian perspective. One of the things I love about Next Fall is that it is a gay story. It centers around this gay couple and their partnership and their relationship, but it's universal. Mm -hmm. and, and I think audiences just beyond the gay and lesbian audiences are going to respond to it, have mm -hmm. discussions about it. We met at a screening of 29th and Gay years and years ago, and we had spoken on the phone um, a couple times prior to Rocky Horror, but we actually didn't work together until Rocky Horror. It was a fun experience. I think we both sort of got thrown into the fire a little bit and had mm -hmm. to find our way out together um, and, and found that we had a good time and a good working relationship. And I was excited that he wanted to come back to San Diego. What don't I consistently put off <laughs> is the question. I wait until the last minute. It gets done, but I wait until the last minute. I like to call it a, a comedy that centers around a very serious situation. Mm -hmm. and, and sort of its driving theme or driving story is about faith. But I think beyond that, I think that's sort of the diving off point for relationship. I think the characters in the play really are looking to connect and looking for uh, how they relate with one another in each other's lives. And for me, it's about family. And it's about the family that we're born into and the family that we choose and build as we become adults.